Nearly 800 officers line the streets of Ocean Boulevard and side streets, working to keep this year's Memorial Day weekend safe for citizens and police. We encourage the officers to continue that relationship building with the public and the attendees that weekend and also with the hoteliers and motelliers all along Ocean Boulevard. So we felt like that officers did a great job of building those relationships. Uh, they interacted with the public well from the feedback that we got and so it made for a very positive weekend. Atlantic Beach Bike Fest coincides with the holiday weekend and according to Myrtle Beach Mayor John Rhodes there were about 300,000 people in the area. He says Saturday was the busiest of the four days. I thank the people that were here looked at the loop and said, you know, we don't need to spend four hours in this loop again, get from one end to the other. So let's, let's just, we've had fun Saturday night. Let's go on. Myrtle Beach Lieutenant Joey Crosby says most of their positive feedback was about the 23 mile traffic loop. Uh, many motorists told us they felt a lot safer in that pedestrians could not just walk out into the highway, so they felt safe traveling up and down the roadway. So that was one of the biggest compliments that we did receive. According to Myrtle Beach statistics released Friday, calls for service were up about 100 from 4,000 last year. Although the, the attendance was down, our calls for service were up. Uh, so officers were very busy handling calls for service and being visible along Ocean Boulevard. Overtime for officers increased from 5,400 hours last year to more than 7,000 hours this year. Lieutenant Crosby says part of that is because all Myrtle Beach police officers worked the Thursday before to start their operational plan. They worked extremely long hours and they worked really hard for the entire weekend to achieve our goal of making the place a safer event uh, for not just the attendees and not just our citizens, but for those that came to assist us.